What's up, Smitty? Is your friend RS9090? This is Zinudu's workshop. Thank you for giving me permission to do an inside tour. No problem. This is a, an air compressor. That runs on a compressed gas. Yes. And converted from an LPG tank. No, 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 that's a reserve tank. Yeah. That gives extra capacity to the big tank. So, yeah. So it gives you more capacity. There's that's an old place. tiller. Yeah. Some welders down here. Mm hmm. These are the two lathes. Those two. Yeah, make sure you give your workshop a vacuum clean. <laughs> Or maybe you can uh, no, melt the shavings in the foundry. No, it's all rubbish, that stuff. Mm. Look, there's your Black & Decker circular saw with the abrasive fibre wheel. Yeah. yeah. It's completely worn down. Yes, well, it's done a lot of work. Yeah, you should get a new fibre wheel. Oh, I've got some there. Mm-hmm. This is an old vacuum cleaner. Yeah, it's the workshop vac. Sanyo. Yeah. Pill of drill. Yeah, you use this to vacuum up all the shavings. That's right. Mm -hmm. And I've got a magnetic broom as well that I made. So that picks them up. There are your motorcycles. Yeah, we'll have a look. Yes. Okay, here's another light here. This is the little share line. Oh, that's great for hobby work. Yeah, that's terrific. If you only got a small shed, you could get something like that. <laughs> hmm. I got a drill stand as well as an angle grinder stand at my house. Right. I was uh, born in Australia. Yeah, alright. Oh, oh you got an accent. Yeah. You want to see these on the cover? Yeah, I'd like to see that bike. It's a Ducati. Mm. Are, you, are you going to plan on selling those? No. No. I've, I've had this one for 36 years. Mm. You should uh, make a, a repro of that stop lens. Mm, you can't buy them anymore. Yeah, all you have to do is uh, make a silicon mould and then cast it out of silicon. I'm just going to shake this now. Yeah, I got a bit of a surprise seeing you. There's another bike here if you want to see. <laughs> Uh, this uh, another G carry. Uh, mm. That was top of the range in '85. Wow! It cost ten and a half thousand dollars in 1985. Mm -hmm. The lenses are still in top nick. Yeah, uh, this has got to be replaced. I'm not, I can't ride at the moment. I've got to get some new indicators for there. They don't make them anymore, so they're very hard to get. They're expensive. Yeah, but they can still be reproed, though, in a oh, silicon see, mould. Yeah, I've got some here. Yeah, I could. I could do it. Or 3D print them. Yeah, I could. But I'm still trying to source some originals, you know. Mm, you should uh, check online via eBay or Craigslist. Yeah, I had a good look. There's the wheelbarrow I did up the other day. Wow. That's the free wheelbarrow. You saw that one, didn't you? Yes. I'll give that to my niece. Yeah. Most of my tools are bought second hand. Mm-hmm. That's how you save money. That's how you can do all this. You buy this stuff cheap, you see. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Rosito. I did a review, a video on that. That mulching up stuff. That was only $50. Mm-hmm. $20 generator. Yeah. So how do you make more money? 
where you, where you don't make much money, you, you buy and, I buy and sell, or mm. bought and sold welders and stuff like this. You don't make a lot of money, but it's just a fun thing, you see? Yeah. yeah. I could do with a, a Bricklink store. A what? Bricklink store. You know, it's a, the, the unofficial Lego marketplace. Right. Yeah. Like, you part out a Lego set and then sell all the individual parts to the customer once. Oh, you do that, do you? Mm-hmm. Make money out of it? Possibly. Hmm. Fun doing YouTube, isn't it? This is a magnifying glass, and the lens is uh, made of rear glass. So you could use this to burn objects with the sunlight. Yep. Belt sander. <laughs> Sharpener. Lathe. Ah 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 Whoa, that's awesome. Has that camera got automatic focus, hasn't it? It does. Well, that's good, yeah. Well, where's the on switch? On the back. Yeah, I'll do it. Too late now, but I'll, I'll vent it. That's a safety precaution. Yep. Always turn it off at, at the cylinder valve first. Yep. Takes the pressure out the hose. Yep. Same thing applies for barbecues. That's right. Still round stuff down there. Mm -hmm. For the lines. You should seek expert advice first before you make your own LPG powered appliances. Yeah. An old barbecue grill. Oh damn those barking dogs. Yeah. Bad news. Yeah, they'll bark at anyone that comes in their direction. Mm. Oh, 
wheelbarrow. Mm -hmm. well, there you go, that's it. What's your name? Uh, my name is Ryan. R Y A N. Right. And I also have a Facebook page too. Oh yeah. Oh, this should be an interesting video for them. Mhm. Mm you should look for me on Facebook. No, I don't do Facebook, but uh, I'll check out your your website and see when the video comes up. Yeah. I make videos using Adobe Premiere Elements. Oh yeah. It's much better than Movie Maker on Windows. Oh, well, that's all I've got. So. I think you've pretty well got everything. Mm -hmm. Oh. That's a vintage Black & Decker tool chest from the 1940s or 50s. Oh. Oh, yep. You're dead right. That hanger was a lead weight, careful. Whoa. And it's an old radio. Just an old Chrysler, I think. Yep. There's some gaskets. Mm -hmm. You can make your own repros of gaskets these days. Yep. A lot of Riga oil cans. Yeah. They're collectible now. Do you like the workshop? I do. And, uh,. Here's a good life hack for you. You should use use a packet of disposable nappies to mop up those oil spills. Well, that's a good idea. How do you like that old lathe? Awesome. Let's see if this hairdryer works. A single speed. Oh, yeah. Mm Well, Smitties, that was a great tour of an old workshop. <clears throat> My name is RS1990. Don't forget to click subscribe. And this is this is in this is Zinadu. Yep, this is Zinadu right there. Don't forget to click subscribe, and I'll see you soon. Take care. See ya.